an ambitious mission to design and construct a cabled observatory in the Pacific Ocean is nearing completion. Once finished, it should dramatically increase our rate of understanding oceanic behavior. We were putting what we call secondary infrastructure, which is instruments and extension cables, onto primary infrastructure, which is a trunk line that allows us fiber optic cable access to the internet and delivers a tremendous amount of electrical power to the seafloor. And the goal here is to take up a permanent presence in the ocean over entire volumes of the ocean where we can have communications with a wide variety of sensors and num numerous uh, robots that can move about within the environment and send information back on demand. Steer for the green buoy. Steer for the green buoy. And the key here is to begin to understand in their entirety marine ecosystems which consist of complex physics, chemistry and biological interactions. You can't do that by going out with a ship and taking a sample in one place and then moving to another place. Eventually, we hope to understand the entire ocean, but we've got to begin with, with sectors that we can actually characterize quite thoroughly. Can we begin to look at the migration of over a thousand kilometer area? Can we look at the migration of uh, marine mammals or uh, pollution uh, invasion into the ocean? Other examples could be, can we predict big earthquakes ahead of time? Bottom line, the ocean is the life support system of the planet and we do not know how to function within it on a routine basis as if we were there, even if we are not there. And that's what this program's about.